So this is Adobe Spark. Um, and Adobe Spark is an online creative app that allows for digital storytelling. Um, it's great for students uh, to get away from the traditional methods of storytelling and presentations. Um, and it's also good for teachers to find new ways to uh, give lectures and things like that. But overall, you can really do anything with Spark, create graphics, videos, or web pages. Um, for the types of learning that Adobe Spark provides, it's constructivism and cognitivism. Um, for the ease of use, I gave it four out of five stars because it is very easy to use. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. There are a lot of uh, tutorial sections with videos that are very helpful as well. Privacy-wise, Spark does have a privacy policy, um, but there is quite a bit of information a user provides when signing up as well as all the stories that um, go out there on the web. Accessibility, they have an accessibility statement, um, but in that statement um, it says that captions are not able to be put on videos, so that's definitely a downfall um, for people that need to access videos with captions. Uh, class size, it's meant for one user, but as I said, it's great for teachers finding new ways to give uh, presentations with a lesson plan video or a report. There is a login required for Spark, but it is very simple with either Google, Facebook. Um, ICT standards that it covers are the Knowledge Constructor, Innovative Designer, and Creative Communicator. Uh, students need to practice all three of those to really use Spark to its fullest. And it is COPA and FERPA uh, compliance, so that's great as well. And overall, Spark is just a great tool for students um, to use and get away from traditional methods, but to also practice skills that are becoming more prevalent uh, in society as technology grows and grows at its rapid rate. Um, so I really encourage everyone to use Spark. Just get out there. You can really um, customize anything, a video page or graphic to the extent that you want. So, I mean, just get out there, try it out, practice, and have fun doing it. Spark is a great tool.